I've told you. There was something wrong with the paddle. Not the canoe story. No, there was. There was something wrong with the paddle. You had your foot wedged against the river. Because it was fast moving water. I was worried about the two of you. You'd have been the first to complain if we'd have hit the rocks. <laughs> there were kids paddling faster than you. <laughs> but they were supposed to be rapid. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm sure there was. Tom just uh, not on that particular river, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I think I can make this for your mum. Um, as long as it's without the chocolate sauce. You're close, aren't you? Your family. I guess. I mean, mum and dad do each other's heads in, but they love me and Chloe. Cool. I know my mum's gonna really like you once she gets to know you. <laughs> You're weird. I mean, you act dead confident. But you're not, are you? You OK? Just, uh, haven't been around family in a while. Forget how it feels. If the girl does not understand you, be patient. It's not her fault. She does not have wisdom. Oh, my God, that's really freaky. It says that your lucky number is ten. If the boy knew how you felt about him, he'd learn to chill. And how does she feel? I do remember a certain first date. Oh, never mind. You tried your best. <laughs> <laughs> need to get another bloke in here for protection. Hmm. Well, while you do that, I need to use the bathroom. Um, and if you hear a crash, you know I didn't make it, so come and get me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you do walk straight into them, don't you? Well, humour's a very attractive trait in a man. So is an extremely large personality. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Come in if you want, I just thought it was easier not locking the car up, you know. No, it's not that, Jack. Bloody typical. The one letter I need to get off. Fine, the LEA are just gonna have to get out on Tuesday, aren't they? You can't send it. You did it on purpose. That's you all over, isn't it? She's out there trying to stab you in the back and you're trying to save her job. She didn't stab me in the back. Oh, yeah, but you do know what's coming, don't you? Oh, no. Come on! Oh, no. Come on, you've got to. Like, no. Yes, no. you've got to. Come on, then. Oh. Oh. Can you remember this? Every Friday. <laughs> <laughs> right, whatever happens in the cottage stays in the cottage, right? All right, then. We won't tell. I'll, I'll just give you a little bit of clock. <laughs> Oh, 
CMS makes me so tired. Well, do you want me to get you something? You know, I've really loved tonight. <laughs> me too. You know, I think it's the bladder and bowel stuff. I think that's the worst. Hey, come on. You don't know what's going to happen, so don't be thinking like that. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. And I, and I know lots of people just get on with it, but... But I really think that's what I would have found the worst. No, no, nah. no, come on. Don't be thinking like that, right? Because just say it is, right? Just say it is. Then we'll cope. It's worse than that, Lorne. Look, whatever it is, right, we'll find a way through it, I promise. Come on, have another drink. No, no, I'm OK. I'm going to go now. Oh. And you two... You two are going to stay up and you're going to get really pissed. Huh. <laughs> And you're going to do something in the morning you're going to regret. <laughs> I think we just did that. You did. Uh, you did. <laughs> night is. No, night. Night, night, Tom. Night. I love you. All right, now, you have definitely had too much to drink. Go to bed, missus. <laughs> Go inside. Let's talk about this. You go in. Let me daft. I'm not leaving you sitting here on your own. Get all your stuff and go. Please. Oh, come on, Jack. This is crazy. Get everything out! There's a number for a cab by the phone. Leave your key. Nothing happened with me and Brett at Waterloo Road. Nothing. What Steph's talking about was before then. I didn't even know he was Roger's son, let alone a student. I... Look at me. It was one night in a bar. That's all you had to say to me. Well, I'm telling you now, aren't I? Anything you want to know, I'll tell you. You've made a fool out of me. No, you're doing it all by yourself. You... Come on, Jack, it's me and you. It's all that matters. We're good together. I do fine by myself. Stop talking like this. I, I bloody love you. Don't do this. If you love me, you wouldn't lie to me. Now, get out. Just left the dishes. Hmm. That's not like Lorna. 
And I just got an A while I was spending a fortune on a trip. She said I'm gonna go now. Yeah, to bed. What's wrong with that? She didn't say I'm gonna go to bed, did she? She, she said I'm gonna go now. It's the new loan. Yeah. And when she was talking to me about symptoms and stuff, she said, um, that's what I would have found the worst. Well, why, why did she talk to me in the past tense, Tom? Well, I don't know. Lorna? Lorna? Lorna! Lorna, come on, come on. Don't do this to me. Come on, Lorna, look at me. Look at me. Come on, come on. Lorna, Tom! Hurry up! Is that ambulance on its way? Come on. Come on, just open your eyes. Open your eyes. Tom, please. Go on, Elvie. Go on, Elvie. I need to get her up. Lorna, come on. Come on. I've just got to get her up. I've got to get her moving. Come, come, come on, you stupid girl. Come on, I can't live there. Come on, you've got to come back to us. Lorna. No flame and reason to go. You've got your whole life ahead of you, and we're going to be there for you always. Lorna, come on. Lorna, come on. Come on, Lorna. We, uh, missed one. Brett. This must have cost a fortune. You couldn't put a price on it. It was my mum's. But I can't take that. Well, since you won't let me buy your stuff, you're going to have to. Because I want something that says that we're together. My dearest Tom and Izzy, don't be sad. I'll be in the place that I've wanted to be for a long time now. I've been a coward about my MS, I know that. It's not the only reason, just the final reason. Know that this is my choice. I've tried to make things as straightforward as possible. There's money for my funeral. I'd like a humanist ceremony, please. Not too keen on God right now. And if people could donate to the MS fund instead of flowers, then it will ease my conscience for walking away while others, braver than me, stay and fight. Don't forget me. Not ever. You are my friends, my family. You meant everything. I'll always love you. Your Lorna. Come on. We're not going to leave her on our own. <laughs> 